there are changes ahead, but we are confident that all will work well because we have superb staff and girls making sure that things will work out for the best. After July, we will be continuing as the Old Cronians, or the Old Crows, um, completely separately, though, from Old Palace. We will just continue in the same way. <laughs> Well, it was known in the area and everybody seemed to sort of love us from the word go. I suppose because we were totally different, really, from sort of the high school or anybody round about, really. You know, friendliness, happiness, thinking of others. Sixteen years. Lovely years they were. What I was looking forward to when I first came uh, was the fact that it was a uh, school for five-year-olds right through to 18-year-olds. But it was also a school where their minds were stretched and they were encouraged to think and to learn how to study and that to Theodora Clark was so important that they learned how to learn. From the Limes we were always taught about thinking about less fortunate people. There was always an appeal to help people in Uganda or refugees in other countries or even local old people through our passes at Christmas and I think that certainly helped to set my values because I have always been very involved in helping, in helping other people now. When you meet girls that went to Cromehurst, everyone's quite a similar kind of person. Um, and I think it just gives you a good, good start in life, really. It's a place where every girl in the school could achieve her maximum potential. What is embodied in Cromehurst, the whole essence of it, will still be carried on. Today, there's 14 of us gonna meet up for a, a bite to eat after this. And everyone's just really, I feel, well-rounded, all in different directions in life. Doctors, solicitors, dance teacher, media, marketing. It offered the whole spectrum, really, for us to all go in these different directions. So Miss Budgem was the headmistress when I was here at Crownhurst, and she was a very inspirational figure um, for many of us. Um, I know she'll always be a light in my life. Ladies and gentlemen, we'd like to uh, welcome you warmly to this summer farewell party organised by the Parents Guild, uh, managed by Lisa Allen, who's put in so much effort. <laughs>